This video is about vertical analysis which is also called common size analysis. We will apply vertical analysis on balance sheet items. We have the balance sheets as at June 30 for years 2012, 2013, 2014, and 2015. All values are in million dollars. In order to do vertical analysis, we express all balance sheet items as percentage of total assets for each year. Please note that total assets is always equal to total liabilities and total shareholders equity. Let's write vertical analysis in cell G1. Copy the same formatting of the balance sheet using the brush. In cell H2. Write equal B2. Press enter. From the small box on the right bottom. Drag to cell K2. Now we have the years of analysis. In cell G3. Write equal A3. From the small box on the right bottom. Drag to cell G19. Now we have the components of the balance sheet. Copy the same formatting of the balance sheet using the brush. The vertical analysis of cash in year 2012 is the cash in year 2012. Divided by total assets in year 2012. Stay in cell H3. The formula would be equal. Choose the cell of B3. Divided by cell B19. Press F4 to fix the cell. So you can drag downward instead of rewriting the formula. We need to do some formatting to reflect the percentage. Highlight the cells. Right click. Choose Format Cells. Under Numbers. Choose Percentage, press OK. Then I will drag them downward. The cells will update automatically. I will do the same with year 2013. Stay in cell I3. The formula would be equal. Choose the cell of C3. Divided by cell C19. Press F4 to fix the cell. Then I will drag them downward. The cells will update automatically. I will do the same with year 2014. Stay in cell J3. The formula would be equal. Choose the cell of D3. Divided by cell D19. Press F4 to fix the cell. Then I will drag them downward. The cells will update automatically. I will do the same with year 2015. Stay in cell K3. The formula would be equal. Choose the cell of E3. Divided by cell E19. Press F4 to fix the cell. Then I will drag them downward. The cells will update automatically.